of my 10 days of horror stream and this is finger bones this is uh <laughs> psychological horror and i don't know anything about it so this is gonna be fun i i know um in finger bones <laughs> yeah Finger Bones is intended to be completed in a single sitting, and there is no save function. It is suggested that you set aside about half an hour to complete it, so I should be done in about half an hour if I know what I'm doing, <laughs> which I don't. <laughs> okay, so I can either exit or can I move? Yeah, I can move. Yes, this isn't point and click. Good. In Serena, I was kind of annoyed that I couldn't move. <laughs> but, I mean, that was fine. It created atmosphere. Uh, can I... Hold on. Can I... The mouse sensitivity is a little... There we go. Okay. I can't open any of these things? Why am I here? This building isn't even finished yet. Why am I here? What is that? Oh! Oh, why do I need a flashlight? That's never good. Uh-uh. What's this? What's this? Is that supposed to be where something is going? Because I can't really click on it or anything. I don't know- oh, I didn't- <laughs> I don't know why I used my daughter's name as a door lock code on my survival bunker, but whatever keeps her happy, I suppose. She's like her mother, a delicate, fragile version of her mother. Damn her. What? I, I, I don't know about the boogeyman, but... <laughs> Why is there? Makes you think about ICP song. Oh, jeez. It's my okay, week. I thought I wanted to enjoy listening to ICP, so. Uh. Well, yeah. The baby used the baby My, um, my sister knows a lot of their songs by heart, and it's kind of scary. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Okay, it's my weekend to get Katie, but I'm not really in the mood. I distracted her with the TV and came here to read. I couldn't interest myself in reading, so I tried to write. I couldn't write anything more than the usual handful of disconnected thoughts and theories. Medication didn't help, and divorce certainly didn't help. Because I am not depressed, I am enlightened. This is the result of two decades of scientific education and philosophy philosophical pondering. <laughs> this is the price of knowledge. Okay, do I need this knife? Can I can I take the knife and defend myself? Why why do I have a bunch of tools out here? Like nothing is do I have feet? No. Do I have a shadow? No. At least I don't think. I have this flashlight so I can't tell. Okay, what are these books? Don't know. I can't use any of these tools. Okay, so I guess the um, only option now is to leave. Or wait, what's this? Why'd the music get suddenly weird? The heck? The heck? What, what'd I do? What is this? Okay, I guess I can't stop it once I've made it happen. Um... These cobwebs? How long have I been here? <laughs> okay, this is weird. This is already weird, man. Can I not go through here? Okay, so I have to exit. No! <laughs> what? Why do you even have that so 
door. It exited me out of the game. <laughs> what the hell? Did you get exited out of the game? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that was good. No warning or anything, you just clicked my door like What the heck? I didn't realize that would exit me out. Oh my god, what am I supposed to be doing? I'm, <laughs> I'm so confused. It's a psychological horror game. No, like that one, what was that game? It was on GameCube. Zero Darkness? I was. sure to pick them up again just in case I needed them you know to read them and stuff all right what's this it appears to be a page from a manuscript pop pop morality is too reliant on emotions and not reliant enough on rational thought if morality must be determined and I maintain that it is a farce it should not be determined by feeling feelings are nebulous subjective and changeable rather it should be determined by thinking the actions of a natural creature are natural and thus moral, unless a concrete scientific reason can be given to prove them as immoral. I'm watching that movie. Why is that? That disc is being stupid. Oh, hey, I found another page. When I was 15 years old, I lost my vir- oh. I lost my virginity. I shook, I shook uncontrollably the entire time. I felt that same primal excitement yesterday night in the cellar. What? What? She murdering people. I don't even know if it's a girl. Who is this person? They murdering people. Somebody murdering. The hell? Oh. What the? What's the name of my daughter? Shoot, I don't know what the name of my daughter is. I need the name, cause that's the password. Who is Zabata. my daughter? Zabata. The heck? Nah, no. Okay, I need to okay, find... Okay, it's either Amana or it's Anna. <laughs> I don't think it's Anna. Anna DeWitt. Nerd. And your daughter responds to that? No. Okay, her name is Katie. That is a girl. No, 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 the, um, the daughter. The daughter's name is Katie. <laughs> was, was that not right? That's the, that's the password, though, right? Why isn't it letting me do the thing and the stuff? Did I miss something? I don't know, man. Can I go in here yet? Oh, shoot. I can go down into the cellar now. The fuck? I hate this. Oh, my God. I don't like this. Oh, my God. 
It's it's finally happened. The whole world is a chaos of thunder and screams. And when the ashes settle, we will all be wild animals again. I'm ecstatic beyond words. I haven't been able to reach Lynn for several days. And she's probably dead for all I know or care. But Katie was here when it started, and I have no idea what to do with her. Most of the town is dead. Katie and I only survived because we ran to the bunker. Perhaps this is what I've needed, freedom from all the irrational rules and inane social values. Just pure, beautiful survival. What? Zodiac killer. No, they're in freaking apocalypse. Oh, the Zodiac Killer was in American Horror Story Hotel. Oh. Uh, there's more cameo than anything, but... Um, okay, I can't guy, enter like, any of these places. Of no, there was a thing called Devil's Night. Uh, the hell? November 30th every year. Every serial killer that had anything to do with um, James Patrick March, the one who created the hotel, yeah. would appear as a ghost in the hotel, and they would all... Oh, have dinner together. Yeah. And it was a bunch of famous serial killers like um, Jeffrey Dahmer and they had the Zodiac Killer there but he wore masks because nobody knew his existence and didn't want anybody to know his existence so he never said anything he just wore a mask. I'm still thinking this should be able to put 10 They had um, <laughs> Eileen went out what do I like do? Famous now? killers. Maybe it's in all caps. What? No. Oh, I was trying to figure out if maybe the password was in all caps or something. Oh no, I just went out of the game and I booted it back up and it's fine. We're all good. I'm still, I'm just trying to figure out what I'm trying to do here. Guy, please, person, I don't even, I still don't know who you are. I don't know anything about this person. There are cobwebs everywhere though, they've been here for a while. Where's Katie? Is Katie in the cellar? Why aren't we in the cellar? Why aren't we with Katie? Did Katie... Katie. Did Katie die? I'm about to have to go and be fucking die. Wow. <laughs> um, shoot, I'm not seeing anything down up here that I can do. And I can't really do anything in the freaking um, basement here. Ugh. I'm... This is so weird. What can I do? Oh, hey! I found another note. Lovely. I'm just gonna scoot into this corner just in some case something decides to pop out. <laughs> Alright, the tool room has been her name for years now, and I can't bring myself to change it. What? The tool room has been her name for years now. What is that supposed to mean? I don't get what that's supposed to mean. I can't go in there yet. I can't go in there. Oh, another note. I boxed up everything that isn't practical and useful. I burned all the books that weren't for scientific ed ed edification. <laughs> Is that a word? Yes. Edification. That's weird. I'd like to store the boxes in cellars, but I can't. I can, I'd like to so store the boxes in the cellar, but I can't get them down the ladder by myself. I just piled them up near the hatch. The blood would probably ruin them. The blood will probably ruin them anyways. What? 
What? What? Can't open that yet. Can't open that yet. What? <laughs> I don't like this. Is there another note over here that I missed or something? Oh my god, what the heck? Boxed everything up. Does it have to do with the boxes? Should I be, like, rooting through all the boxes and such? And what about that? Is this a special box? It's over here. I'll... The fuck was that noise? The hell was that? There was a noise and I didn't like it. Huh? The hell is other noises. I don't even know what you just said. Oh, it was the generator. Gotta hate you. <laughs> Too loud. Freaking me out. Oh, hush. I'm just trying to find, like, my reason for living over here. Like, we're in the apocalypse, man. What, what, what was going on here? Why is this chair all the way in the middle here? What is going on? We're so unkempt. Like, this building hasn't even been completed yet. Why are we here? What even is this place? <laughs> is this, did it used to be a home? Like, and what? Why is there like a dent in the wall? Oh my god! <sighs> Don't spook me. That's rude. That's so wait, the something about the tool room. Um <laughs> why am I even putting this? The tool room. <laughs> um, all these are boarded up. It's not make any sense. What's above us? More importantly, what's outside? What does the outside look like? Can I do anything with this? behind there. Can't look. Hmm. This is really weird. I, I, I actually have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. It's Thing about the and, and I'm like I'm afraid to go down like what if I go down so many times something happens you know what what if I'm like what if I like make something happen I don't like it I don't know man um, that's better than nothing happening I guess so but it's still it's just like I have this like thing where I'm just like I'm kind of worried that something's gonna like scare me you know but yeah I guess that's what it's supposed to do but still um let's see I mean it's a psychological aura though so I shouldn't be really worried about something popping out at me but <laughs> mm. Okay, wait, I'm gonna go and put Katie into the thing again. See if it does anything.
Because now that I've looked at that... Why am I going slow? Oh, I was stuck. I was like, what the heck is happening here? Like... We know there's blood. So, did we murder our daughter? Saw what happened. Am I gonna go down there and it's gonna be like dead? Fucking dead. Huh? You want the truth. No. You can't handle the truth. I really can't. I I'm I'm I am i am i am a scaredy cat man. Love you too. I seriously don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I can't protect you from the apocalypse. You're on your own on that one. Hey, rude. We'll survive the apocalypse together. Yeah, really. Apocalypse. And it's going to be a clips. Am I missing something? Hey, we're all furries here. I didn't say furry. You said the paw collapse. Yeah. Okay. Which everyone knows is when the furries take over. What about uh, Lynn? It's the name that will come in. I would have said that the skeleton more than any day. No, other fucking skeleton. It will be the day when puppies flood the earth. Mm hmm. I'm gonna try Lynn. Okay, I don't think anything happened. <sighs> and I, I just don't know. I'm so confused, man. I mean, it's the daughter's door lock. So it's gotta be Katie, but like, is there a certain way that he puts it into the keypad? Like, is there? Um. How about like replacing with like letters and stuff? I don't know. There's so many combinations that it can be. How about all lowercase? Or maybe like C four T I E uh C A T one E. Um maybe it's like a full name. Like Catherine. I don't know. Um shoot. <laughs> How about like a nickname like Cat? <sighs> this is ridiculous, man. I, I need to s need to see what's going on, man. Then. And why did I even turn this on? <laughs> what is this? Is it really like a generator, like I'm thinking, or is it like... I'm not even sure. <laughs> Dang it. Oh! I opened something. The hell, it's really dark in here. Okay, what's over here? Another note. Huh? Huh? I love you. Oh, I love you too, nerd. <laughs> I changed the storage room code to something I can easily remember. NNY. The rest of the world is missing. The hell? weird room. It's all like dark and stuff. I don't like that it's so dark. It's creeping me out. 
Okay. What's this? There. What is that noise? Hell no. There are things I've wanted to do for years. Desires I've kept locked in the back of my consciousness. It's been nearly a year since I've seen a woman, and now I realize there's no practical reason to keep those desires locked up anymore. Oh. Okay. What? What is that supposed to mean? Um, I think this is going somewhere where I do not want it to go. <laughs> Um, well, he had his daughter. Uh-huh. Yeah. And he hasn't yeah. seen a woman in... Yeah. Yeah. A low, low <sighs> She remembered Father's Day and drew me a picture. I don't understand her. She's just like her mother. She wanted to waste time drawing pictures, and we're barely able to find enough food to survive. I turned her crayons into candles. We need more candles, in case the generator goes out again, and it helps break up the monotony. I yearn for the excitement of those first weeks. The hell? Stop making it sound so creepy. Okay, there are... Oh. There are tools all over this, and there are blood stains on the table. Yeah. Totally sane. Totally sane. Okay, I need to put in the password NNY. The music is getting weirder. Please don't. Don't spook me. I don't want to get spooked. <laughs> You're gonna get spooked. No, I refuse. Okay. So the password okay. is NNY. You are getting spooked. Okay. What's this room gonna be? I'm afraid. I know when I get down to the cellar, it's just gonna be a blood pool, isn't it? Huh. What? I thought that would open that. I put in the password. I'm not sure. There's still something I need to like read over here. Or... <sighs> so many cobwebs. Oh hey, do I need that? No, it's just there. Not for me to pick up. Awesome. Well, I still can't go in there. Hmm. Thinking. Is there like a? Well, when I go back upstairs, the store closes again, so I put in the other passcode. Oh, wait, is it like the whole thing? The, um, NNY, and then in those weird things, the world, the rest of the world is the missing? Maybe. The rest of the world is missing. 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 Was that a key on the Huh? No, it wasn't. It was a wrench. Oh, okay. Love you too. Oh, I can't even. I guess it's the rest of the world is missing. No, I can't even. What? That's way too long. <laughs> Dang it. Um. Hmm. 
N N Y. It was N N Y. Try New New York. What? Try New New York. New New York. I already suggested that earlier. Really? I didn't hear you. <laughs> I'm sorry. It was the first time you saw that letter. Back down into the creepy basement. Don't like it. Love. Love you too. Okay, that didn't work. The rest of the world is missing. The rest of the world is missing. Maybe there's hints in these. NNY is like the last part. Oh, the rest of the word is missing. Oh, okay, so it's only part of the world, the word. I thought it was the actual code. Um, NNY. What can be a part of NNY that would probably be a passcode to a storage room? Huh? Yeah. What? I don't know. Sorry. I'm just I mean, are we going to be keeping with the theme of names as passwords? I have no idea. Because you could try something like Jenny or, or something like that. Jenny? But does it have anything to do with... Jenny? I don't know. I'm just thinking... Because the last password was a name, so... Yeah. Well, there's, um... I keep saying world, but I do mean word. I'm serious. I'm just, I, I just keep, it comes out better. World versus word. Word is so stiff. The world, the world opens up. Okay, but anyways. <laughs> Wife's name was Lynn. What? No, I'm um So maybe it's like it could be Lynn. But that's kind of out of order. Um it could also be maybe Kate. Well yeah, I already typed it. Um
because um Did we get the um the dad's name yeah? No, we don't know his name. He's very uh That could be like Danny or something like that. Danny. Like going with the MMR. Yeah. Or Benny. Something like that. Try to up. Nah. Love you too, but I'm not gonna keep going down each time. I'm just gonna put it in as many things as I think of. <laughs> uh, okay. We'll never know. So, could be Danny, could be, um, Benny. I said, I said Timmy. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, I looked it up. I know what it is. If you want me to tell you. Okay. You're probably never gonna guess. All right. It's N N Y capital L. What? Oh, it's so it's Lynn backwards. That's so clever. Yeah, you it's technically you're technically right. Yeah. Wow. Uh, I'm glad you looked it up, to be honest. I, I was gonna be stuck on that forever. <laughs> yeah, I looked it up for you because I was about to get off. <laughs> oh, okay, what's in here? Oh, it's just a simple room. I guess I'm near the end. What is that? I don't want to press that yet. Something's gonna happen. I'm gonna read that first. I am a bag of DNA, and I exist to make more of myself. I married and produced a daughter because my genes demand reproduction. I wrote books and created because creativity served a survival advantage to my ancient ape ancestors. I built this place, took refuge in it, and spent hours thinking up silly little artificial laws to live by. Because my forefathers built cities and societies to allow time and peace to reproduce and to protect their genes. Dreams, loves, opinions, desires, beauty, innocence, figments of our collective primordial Im imagination. Fleeting electrical signals that fire across our subnosis for a pointless amount or moment in time. They used to serve a purpose, and now they are in needless confusion, and here I am, the last man on earth for all I know, ready to be freed from them. What the hell? <laughs> you ain't that deep, bro. I mean, like, mmm, he... Alright, let's press that. I don't know what I just pressed. But I pressed There's it. There's one more code you're gonna have to put in before it's over. Okay. How how do I like um? Can I open this now? No. <sighs> Is there something I'm missing then? Because it didn't say anything about a code. Yeah, no, no, just keep looking around. Awesome. I'm afraid. <laughs> I'm afraid about finding something that I do not want to find. I can't, like, go back there. Can I close this? No. What was that? Did I just hear a little girl? Is she crying? You pressed the button, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Is she crying? Wait, should I go upstairs? I probably need to go upstairs, don't I? What's gonna happen? Is she gonna be up there? What's going on? Do you know something, Chris? No, I only know the stuff to finish the game. I don't know what happens in between. Okay. Okay, um... <laughs> um. 
Yes. No. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Like so then, yeah. what would be the last password? Well, look around. Something changed on in this room. In the top room. Yep. Okay. I'll look around. Okay. I was playing a Kirby vlog. I don't really like when things change, but that things are happening and and things happen but it's weird and I heard a little girl crying. Jesus. She is probably not dead but she's crying. She's crying. It's crying. Am I like in the right direction? I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh, getting colder. Okay, so the near the bookshelf was cold, I'm guessing. I don't know. Yeah, near the bookshelf was cold. Okay, should I, should I be getting like, warmer? Getting warmer? Yes. Going towards the desk is warm. Warmer. Warmer. Okay, so it doesn't have what? I don't know. I you're out of sync. It, it's because you wait. I see it. No. Uh, the seller is freedom. Does that mean that freedom is the password? I don't know. Wanna try? I'm gonna try it with both the capital and without one because you never know. Okay. I'm gonna go down in the cellar now. Wish me luck. It's gonna. Shush. You shush. You shush. you're really responsible for your health after this. I am so scared, man. Wait, what am I responsible for? Nursing him back down. Uh, I'm not a nurse. I heard a oh, scream. And, uh, even if I were in the medical profession, I, my professional diagnosis would be that he's me on my head. There's only enough food for one, so she's gonna die anyway. I'm free now. Freedom. It looks like the end of all humanity for me to find freedom. What's down oh, here? I am freaked out, man. I'm freaked out. I don't like it. There is a lot of blood. It seems to have been torn from a diary. She finally died last night. I don't know whether from starvation, dehydration, or blood loss. I threw her body into the woods. Her fingers, my anti-religious artifacts, my testaments, to moral and intellectual freedom are locked in the safety upstairs. Or the safe. I am content in my knowledge that I haven't done anything wrong. What? That was that was her fingers next to the paper. What? The father didn't know why he'd come back after all these years, starving and tired. He just wanted to see the cellar one last time. With one last flicker, the flashlight died and he was left in the pitch dark. He sat down on the cold floor and closed his eyes. He could still hear her even now. It was peaceful in here, here in the cellar. It was free here in the cellar. And it just ends. What the hell? Yep. That's it. You playing as the dad. Well, yeah, I knew I was playing as the dad, but... And you cut off your daughter's fingers and store them in a safe. This is so creepy. And you kept all of the food to yourself so she died of either blood loss, starvation, or dehydration. And then you left the bunker, dumped her body in the woods, and left for lord knows how long. And eventually just came back. Don't know why. And then you proceeded to... Your flashlight proceeded to die while you were in the cellar. And... And that's that's the end. You either stay in the cellar and die, or 
the, the ending was up to, for you to interpret. Wow. Yeah. He just sits down in the pitch black of the cell with no flashlight. That entire time I was expecting something to, like, jump out at me. <laughs> I'm so it very was annoying. It psychological war. It was by no means. Yeah. I know. But it was still, it was like the atmosphere it was creating. That's a psychological war. Uh, I know. Oh my god. I think it's the atmosphere more than I do cheap jump scares. Yeah, well. <laughs> oh yeah, my stream there. Ugh. <laughs> oh. I have a lot to think about. <laughs>